Now the reason why I have purchased the blue armor chin mount is because the chin section of my helmet is very edgy. If you can see from the side profile, uh, the design is very sharp and there is uh, no flat surface where I can stick the usual mounts. So I wanted something else which will be a good fit uh, for this particular helmet. There are some flat sections on the side where you can uh, stick your usual mounts but that is not uh, what I was going for. I wanted something which I can have front and center and that is the reason I purchased the blue armor mount. You can see that it is, a, it is quite flexible when it comes to the attachment and also uh, the, uh, the side panels that it has, they are flexible so you can like uh, so you can adjust it according to the design that your helmet has right so once i stick it uh, this is how it will look it gives me an option to fit the mount perfectly to the shape of my helmet and also uh, i will be able to stick it even though uh, if you can see even though the bottom two panels they are in a in sort of a v shape so it is not really flat it is in a sort of a v shape but because it is uh, because this thing is split it will stick one other thing uh, that you should note if you are purchasing this, it comes with a 3M tape on the back which you can attach to the helmet and usually what people do is they just peel off the helmet and they stick, uh, they just peel off the tape and they stick it on the helmet. But that is not, uh, that is not something that will last uh, in extreme weather conditions. So the best way to go about it is to heat the tape with a hairdryer or something and also clean the section where you are going to stick it. So doing that will give you a far better um, will give you a far better uh, addition compared to uh, just peeling off the tape and sticking it. So let's see, uh, I'll install it on my helmet and then we'll see how it goes. space to install my action camera now and um, I think uh, this vent will not be covered by the action camera since the mount is quite uh, low down and you can see that this has stuck quite nicely on the on the edges of the chin and um, let's see how it goes I will definitely do a short ride soon and I will share my feedback with you. 